time has this fascinating habit of growing wings when you're having fun. It's already time for episode two of The Digital Dish. Greetings and welcome. My name is Denver Kisting. Thank you very much for all the likes, for all the shares, for all the subscriptions, for all the love that you've shown episode one of The Digital Dish. Please continue to do so. As a reward for you, we'll be serving you some fresh interviews and a surprise for episode two. We'll be engaging the head chef of Multi-Choice Namibia, that's the managing director, Roger Gerze, and he'll be talking to us about all things Olympics. Tying in with what he has to share with us in this episode, we'll also be engaging our head of marketing, Abilene Bood, and she'll be telling us how they're packaging and presenting the story relating to specifically the Olympics. What all of this means is don't go anywhere. To watch your favorite stars, characters, and team on any screen, just tap tap to download the app from your app store. That is ridiculous! Tap tap to enjoy your DSTV favorites on the DSTV app. Welcome back. This is episode two of The Digital Dish. Our head chef, the managing director of Multi-Choice Namibia, Roger Gerze, now joins me to talk to us about all things Olympics. Greetings, Roger, and welcome to The Digital Dish. Thank you for having me, uh, Denver. Always a pleasure. What we do know is that matters are in full swing in Tokyo, Japan. How have you, as Multi-Choice Namibia, been ensuring that either as a DSTV or as a GoTV subscriber, I have not been missing out on any form of the action. Through our sister company, Supersport, the world of champions is bringing us the Olympics in Tokyo in real time to our uh, setting rooms. And we are very delighted for what they could uh, bring to us. You would know by now that our XS subscribers enjoy two dedicated Olympic channels. Our family subscribers on DSTV, uh, they enjoy four channels. Our Compact subscribers, six brilliant channels, and then our, our Compact Plus subscribers, eight channels. For our premium subscribers, the cherry on the cake, uh, we are giving them eight channels plus the Grandstand channel. The Grandstand channel, of course, is where the magazine shows are happening, where there's direct uh, information coming from, from the Olympics. And I'm pretty sure that our uh, uh, subscribers on DSTV is really enjoying the Olympics. For our GoTV subscribers for the first time, we also have four channels available uh, for them on, on the GoTV Plus and GoTV Max channels. The message that I hear loudly and clearly is that no one in this multi-choice family is left out. Nobody should be feeling left out. As you are rightfully saying, all of those great channels are available on GoTV and DSTV. So we are very uh, excited to bring special offers to our DSTV and GoTV potential customers. For DSTV, we have got a fully installed 1099 Namibia dollars on offer for a fully installed DSTV kit plus one month compact subscription. So really affordable. We have for GoTV uh, 349 Namibia dollars uh, with a complimentary month offer of, of GoTV plus subscription. All of these offers are available at our install a network across the country, 120 of them. We have a retail network of over 300 um, uh, retailers. And then on top of that, we've got 33 agents across the country where, where our customers can go and, 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 and get connected as quickly as possible so that they can really enjoy the second half of, of the Olympics in, in, in Tokyo. In closing, Denver, I would really like to wish our athletes well in this competition, and we are looking forward to receiving them at the Osea International Airport with, with the medals that they are bringing from the Olympics this year. If on this 29th of July 2021, some Namibians are still under the impression that the first prize is to be in Tokyo, I think they're mistaken. First prize is to grab either a DSTV or a GoTV subscription. Denver, you are 100% right. We have our Explorer decoders with HD functionality, pause, rewind to, to relook at those great moments in Tokyo. We have our HD zappers that are also HD quality and uh, our GoTV subscribers are also not left uh, behind because it's HD quality, 
pristine uh, uh, sound quality on both platforms. So it's really bringing Tokyo into our sitting rooms. And whilst we are under lockdown, whilst this dreadful disease is with, is with us, there's no other better way of bringing entertainment and uh, bringing it in a safe and, and, uh, and, and healthy way to our subscribers. So here's to great Olympics and here's to a great Olympics for Namibia. Roger, thank you very much. We look forward to having you back on The Digital Dish. Thank you very much. At MultiChoice in Namibia in general, and at The Digital Dish in particular, we stay true to our promises. So next up, we serve you the surprise for episode two. Watch Africa rise in the land of the rising sun. It's the first time in Olympic history Champion. Watch them rise at Tokyo 2020 on eight dedicated channels. On Supersport, your world of champions. Get connected with DSTV. Broadcast proudly brought to you by Sportybet. Welcome back. This is episode two of The Digital Dish. As promised earlier, we're serving you a huge surprise in this second episode. With me today are Heng Burta, coach of our two beautiful ladies, Christine Boma and Beatrice Masilingi. Hello and welcome. Thank you for having us. Hank, before I give these ladies an opportunity to tell us what it feels like to be representing the land of the brave at the Olympic Games this year, what does it feel like for you to be holding space for them in the way that you have been doing so well thus far? I'm so happy for them and, and I'm so honored and privileged to work with them. Mm. What does it feel like to be in the hands, Beatrice, of Hank? Um, I'll first love to say um, he's a wonderful coach. I mean, he's a wonderful man himself. Um, he's a father figure and i um, really happy to be with him as my coach. So um, everything is just amazing. Yeah. Mm. Christine, so you'll be traveling to Tokyo um, in the next couple of days. And DSTV and Supersport will be bringing all the action to Namibians, to your loved ones, to your fans. What message do you have for them? I would like to say... They must enjoy watching me and I will just go there and just do my best. And bring back all the gold. <laughs> no, I can say gold now. Yeah. It's a big competition for me. I'll just go do my best. We're super proud of what you've accomplished thus far already. And we're excited to see what you will deliver in Tokyo. But just what is your message for your fans? By the way, I'm one too. Um, I would just love to thank you guys for your support, um, the love, um, it's incredible and I'm really happy for having you guys, it's my backbone, so to say, so thank you guys for everything. Hank, Multi-Choice Namibia is delighted to be part of this journey and to play a small part. What has your experience been about corporate Namibia and the support from Namibians uh, to the girls? Yeah, obviously uh, this journey and this sport is not uh, possible without the support of multi-choice, uh, uh, bringing it to the people in a difficult time like now with COVID. People can see us and they can be part of us, uh, otherwise there wouldn't have been something like that. And the same with the corporate world, supporting us, helping us for the preparations and everything. So we are so thankful and, and we can't do this without you guys. Before we let you go, before we say goodbye to you, Christine, one final thing. What is it that you're excited about, about visiting Japan? I'm just looking forward to, to run in Japan. And you, Beatrice? Um, I want to try to sushi and uh, definitely go and compete. Ooh. So are you keen about the sushi? You haven't had sushi before? I did have. My coach took me for my first sushi in here in Banduk. Yeah. <laughs> so I had one at the mall. So it was really good. So I want to try that side. Henk, in the last word from your kant af? Ja, baie dankie en allemaal uh, support outside there en, en ons gaan Tokyo toe met twee 18-jarige meisjes en uh, net, net die feit dat hulle daar is, is een ongelooflike prestatie al klaar. So uh, van my kant af, uh, ek dink daar, daar lê baie mooi goed op die atletiekbaan van Namibia voor with these beautiful women and, and they will make Namibia proud. I don't have any doubt about that. Thank you very much. We're eternally grateful to you for this honor. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> there you have it. Our beautiful girls who will be making us proud at the Olympics this year. We'll be back after a brief break. We were born for this moment to make the impossible possible. To create moments that inspire and live the thrill of excellence. 
forget the past, for the future awaits. This is that moment we've all been waiting for. The Olympic Games Tokyo 2020. It's go time on Go TV. Love it. And here I'm sitting today with uh, two beautiful ladies that is making Namibia proud uh, on, the, on the athletics track. Uh, what I really want to say on behalf of all of us here at Maldi Choice Namibia, our subscriber base out there in the whole of Namibia, that we are super proud of what you have achieved so far, Christine and Beatrice. And we are looking forward to a great Olympics, watching you two um, um, running in the lead uh, on the 200 meters uh, event for women. All the best and good luck. And we are 100% behind you, not only at the, at the Olympics, but also beyond. Also to coach Hank that are supporting these two ladies. Thank you very much for what you have done for them. And we are looking forward to great support uh, uh, from your side as well. From Maldi Choice Namibia, I have pleasure to hand yourselves each one a Explorer, DSTV Explorer decoder uh, to, to take uh, with uh, so that uh, your family and friends can also watch you when you are there in Tokyo participating at this year's Olympics. And we really uh, are looking uh, forward to, to the games. Thank you guys very much for the Explorer. And um, thank you for all the support that I'm receiving from my family and friends out there and the companies that have been sponsoring me. And um, thank you to my coach here for the work and everything. And I'm really happy for that. Nitu Messi. Thank you, DSTV, for the Explorer and bringing the sport to the nation and throughout Africa for supporting these wonderful girls and supporting us in this journey. Uh, we can't say enough thank you to the whole nation and Africa. Thank you very much. Aren't Beatrice Masilingi and Christine Bomo absolutely stunning? Hope you enjoyed the chat with our girls. They will be running in about three days. Next up, the head of marketing at Multi-Choice Namibia, Abilene Boer. She will be talking to us about the Olympics campaign. Hello, Abilene, and welcome to The Digital Dish. Hi, Denver. Thanks for having me. So you're responsible for the sterling execution of the marketing campaign, specifically relating to the Olympics recently. Talk to us about that, please. Okay, so our campaign this year, what we did is we decided to use our natural athletes from Namibia. So we are very fortunate to have 10 participating this year, and we used them on our DSTV campaign. So we've used an athlete, we've used a rower, as well as a cyclist on our campaign. So we wanted to bring it home a little bit more, and really connect people to the Namibians taking part at this international event. How did you go about bringing it home? Because I think that's quite a critical component of the campaign. Okay, so de despite the, the ads that we use the images on, and the ads are there for the awareness of the offers that Roger talked about earlier, in terms of what you can buy in terms of GoTV and DSTV in terms of the product. But what we've further done is we partnered with the NMH group, and we're using their newspapers as well as their digital platforms to really talk to about the scheduling of the Olympics. So it's all good and well that we can watch the Olympics, but when, where, you know? So that's quite difficult because everybody knows that the Olympics is on DSTV and on GoTV, but it is the land of the rising sun, several hours ahead of them. So our viewers don't really know when they can watch what. And we've partnered with this group in order to tell people, you can watch Christine running at this time, at this stadium, on this channel. And that's really what we wanted to do, to really direct people to where they can watch Namibians taking part, as well as other international athletes, but really get the scheduling of the broadcasting right. So all those channels that we have available on DSTV and GoTV, but what time is it taking place? So that you can record it if you aren't up at that time in the morning, or you can stay up and watch it live depending on, on what, your, what your situation is. Thank you very much for the visit to The Digital Dish. Thank you, Denver. Isn't she absolutely lovely? Evelyn Boer, the head of marketing at Multi-Choice Namibia. And that, of course, brings us to the end of the second episode of The Digital Dish. Please continue to like, to share, and to subscribe. We're kicking up a storm for episode three. Look out for it.